welcome to Jiangsu Darling Factory. Uh, I'm Alice and uh, today I'd like to have a brief introduction of our uh, distribution transformers to you. And now we are in the workshop of our transformers and here is uh, our general type of the transformer. Now have a clear look at the nameplate of today our star. Look the nameplate. Uh, this transformer, the capacity is 500 kVA. And the voltage, the high voltage is 10 kV. Okay, on the top. Now, you can see the color of this transformer is in gray. And on the top, here, here is the high voltage bushings. Uh, we have three high voltage bushings. And the color is... Uh, brown and the material they are in porcelain. Okay, then here we have four low voltage bushings. It's also the color is brown and uh, on the top you can see the conductor with four holes. Okay, on the top we have four lifting eyes, lifting eyes to lifting the whole transformer. And, and then here's an oil indicator to indicate the, le le the level of the oil. You know, here, when the color is blue, it means, yes, the oil is enough. Uh, when it turns to red, then you might, may maybe you need add more oil. And here is the, on the top, it's a press relief device. Okay. And... Now we can see on the top is the tap changer of the transformer. It's uh, at the high voltage side, and it, and it is with five taps. Five taps. Now, yes. How to operate the tap changer? Yes. Here, on the transformer side, four corners, they are the lifting lug. Lifting lug also for lifting the transformer. And now, uh, yes, the sides are the radiators. And here, you can see what kind of oil we use. What kind of oil we use in this transformer. We feel in this transformer. It's number 25, number 25 oil. Okay. Here, have a look at the upside of this transformer. Then, camera, camera here. Here. It's for, uh, it's for the thermometer of the oil. Then maybe if you need, you can put a oil, oil temperature indicator in this hole. And down, down here, we have a drain wave of the oil here. You can see. And this is for grounding. Here's a signal for grounding. At the bottom, we have bases for the whole transformer. Then you can mount them on a uh, concrete on the pole. Blah, blah. Okay, that's all.